Oh yeah. The hype is real. We finally did it. So today was kind of like a weird day. Um, I was working on um, my jacket, my jean jacket, trying to finalize that. I spent the last two days on jean jacket and it's still not completely done. But um, I really didn't want to mess with my, my, my jive. I was just jamming, like straight up jamming and really, really inspired when it comes to clothing. Um, I've gotten like, like on a different level, like just in tune of where I want to go, the direction I want to take. But aside from that, I wasn't going to make a video. I was just going to hold off to be able to do it properly. But I've, I felt like recently I've been trying, I've been holding on to ideas rather than just doing like in previous. So like instead of usually I would just show you something as soon as I get it. But I've been trying, I've been holding back lately, and I don't know why. I just think um, I'm just falling into like a different schedule and I'm trying to do my best like, right now to show you guys as as I get it in um, what I'm doing and what I'm working on and what I'm I got aside from all that we got a new body kit in this is kind of the premise of this video is we got a new body kit um, have to thank JP fiberglass they've worked with us for now two years and um, nothing to say bad about them I destroy body kits <laughs> Um, last year we went through literally side skirts and a front bumper were all trashed by the end of the season without hesitation They're like yep, we'll support you this year again matter of fact We'll give you a full body kit this year showed me this kit that they were that I I didn't really un know until this year and Oh my goodness guys. I'm so happy. I went with it. It is f So cool. I really really like it a lot just so thankful that I have um, the support from you guys, from them, um, and I'm just beyond excited. It's in its rare, raw form. This car is, will transform, and I'm going to do everything proper. Um, so bear with me, but it looks amazing. So, without further ado, here we go. We have a 326, 326 kit. Bumper, side skirts, and rear bumper. I have to fix my rear until um, it's for it to fit because it fits just not with my rear quarter ba bashed because my uh, head ta tail light sags. Oh, I gotta fix my rear to fit it. But oh my goodness, guys, can you imagine? Can you see what I'm seeing? Can you see? Um, Fitment, I want to say spot on. Without, I didn't. These side skirts are just literally pop, popped on. They're not um, drilled in any way. I am thrilled, beyond thrilled with the outcome. Front bumper looks stunning. Again, I'm nothing buttoned up. Like everything has to be tightened up and everything. But I'm just so happy with this kit and how it looks. Uh, oh, and roof spoiler. I never had a roof spoiler, but here we are. I have a roof spoiler. I'm going to rock it one. Why not? Um, I think it looks really, really cool. Gosh, it looks so good. I need to, I need to get that rear bumper on. It looks so amazing. Um, just kind of mocked up. This looks, it looks really, really good when it's all sit, like I, I, I somewhat got the left side in, but. But guys, I just, I'm just so happy. I can't wait to really make this kit because I don't know if you guys are familiar with 326 kits, but they do like a little bit of pinstriping on the like right where here is. They do pinstriping. So the bumper is going to be red and I'm going to follow that pinstriping using probably vinyl or something. And um, it's going to look sick. Like it's going to be painted, but I'm going to uh, mask it out with vinyl. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to replicate how the 326 team paints their body kits. I am 
beyond hype on this. It's gonna look so good. Uh, I wanted to go with overs, but um, we decided to go with fender flares. I'm not a huge fan of fender flares, but um, they should work for the application. Um, that's, that's, yeah. We're gonna do fender flares, worst comes to worst. Um, and also, it'd be nice, because I always blow through tires, and if anything, I'll just break a fender flare rather than destroying a whole over fender. Um, front should be fine. I have to now take off this vinyl. I have a lot of work to do. I gotta fit the whole kit, paint it, um, see, cut my fenders, and I don't know what I wanna do if I wanna just roll my fenders like to the maximum or cut them all the way out. I really don't wanna chop them up. It kinda hurts my heart to cut these fenders or even my rears. Even though my rear's jacked up, I still don't wanna cut it. Even though it's feel like literally rusty, beat up. Yeah, so. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do, honestly. I honestly have no clue. Yeah, uh, I'm basically excited. The only thing I'm gonna be sad about is when I absolutely destroy this body kit. Hopefully I don't do it this year. Um, hopefully, uh, yeah, we don't absolutely kill this kit because it looks really, really good. I'm really happy with everything, everything about this kit. Um, there's also, there's some things I gotta figure out like how I'm gonna mount this wing, um, how I'm gonna fix my rear. <clears throat> do I really, how much do I wanna cut out of my quarter panels? There's a lot, of, a lot of questions in the air, but I promise it's going to look absolutely gnarly. I'm really, really excited about it. I'm really excited about a lot of things. I've gotten really inspired lately. Um, just over, just over life, just like really, really in tune with what I wanna do, how I wanna think, and um, I'm just happy. Like I'm, oh, I'm genuinely happy. And we got through this winter and honestly like you last winter i got so bummed out and this winter i got i hit a couple little little hiccups like here and there mentally but realistically nothing compared to last year and i just feel like i've grown so much and matured so much over the past year and it's just i don't know i'm just really pumped um about the future because i'm just gonna keep you know keep in my own lane and just stay focused and keep pushing we have really 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 cool products coming out um in the next two three months um we have uh, yeah, a bunch of cool surprises. I'm not really, I'm trying to keep everything, I'm trying not to say everything until it's done in my hand and uh, it'll be dope. But with that guys, I wanna make a proper video this weekend on the kit, um, possibly doing some work on it. And, um, but I don't wanna leave you guys in the dark. I don't want you to guys, you guys are my uh, my homies, and I want you guys to feel, you know, as uh, pumped up and and excited for this this season because we got a lot of things to look forward to. I'm super duper excited. Holla at your boy. What do you guys think of the body kit? Have you ever seen a 326 body kit? I've never seen one in the states in person. So, I mean, I know there is one. I'm just saying I've never seen people around here and and also at uh, events so um would you like 326 kits what's your favorite kit on an s13 or s14 um let me know in the comments below holla at you we interrupt our program to bring you this important message guys <laughs> i don't know how to um i don't know how to say this but as you can see, the environment changed. I'm thrilled to announce that we finally got a studio space. I've been working on this for the last couple, like a last month and it's not even done. I just got like, we're just finally in the space. I have so much work to do. This is my big project that, that I've been working on in the background. Um, so I'm super, super pumped to show you it's literally nothing right now, but I'm going to make this space exactly my my main creation cave, where it's gonna have, I'll, I'll br break everything down, but it's gonna have um, kind of like a, almost like a storefront feel for my products, have like, um, like, a, like a different vibe to it, have a workstation, um, just overall production center of all creation. I'm so happy and it's just, everything's just been working out and I'm just so thrilled. Um, so without further ado, let me show you the new space. Area. Right here, I want to do my products. I want to do like a shelving unit for um, all, my, all my products. These are not for this area. This is actually for my booth. Cool lighting, some, 
some cool posters. But on this side is gonna be like my workstation area. Like this area is gonna be the main focus though. And then in the middle, I wanna have like, how like when you're in a shoe store and there's like little things to sit on in front of the products, like kind of like little like couches. I wanna do like a couch, a chilling area. It's not a huge space, but it's my first real studio and I'm so freaking pumped. Um, this is my main, my main jam right now. Like literally this is what I've been working on. This is why, um, you know, that I've just been keeping everything kind of like on the hush, 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 hush puppy dog. So I'm thrilled, I'm so pumped. I don't know whether I want, I kind of want to make this a separate video, but uh, I don't think, I don't know. I just, I just, all the surprises today, all the surprises. And the jackets are done. We just finished these jackets. Um, I'm so thrilled about this jacket. I don't want it. I know I'm, a hit, I'm, a hit, I'm hitting you with everything, but we've literally put so much work into this jacket. It has a sweet freaking um, paracord knot on it. So basically you can put your key like say you're at an event, you put your key on this and put it in your pocket, that way you never lose it. And then you can just pop this bad boy off real quick if you want, or put whatever you're hanging. I just think it like adds to the jacket so much. And it's a, uh, this is para 550 paracord, so if you take it apart, you can literally can hold, hoist 550 pounds, so. Holla, you feel me? Everything, this jacket was like made to be um, basically very, very, um, raw the whole concept behind this jacket is obviously we don't quit my motto or thesis of this year is um, to just not quit and find your cause and and just keep going and and uh, the reason I did it the way I did it because it's not like it's not crazy perfect like I could have went out and got um, I could have went out and got this perfectly screen printed but I didn't want it to be I wanted it to be raw I wanted it to be like very, very, um, kind of like an urban feel. And the whole concept of behind that is because you might have a plan for where you're going, but life just seem, you know, not in a negative way, but life will always th throw obstacles and throw um, good things, bad things. So this jacket is basically representing prepare for everything and don't ever stop. I'm pumped. On the sleeve it says, uh, respect all horsepower. On the bottom of the jacket it says, uh, be about it. And then on the back it says, we don't quit. And then behind, underneath the we don't quit, fear nothing. So I am so pumped. These will be out in a couple, like maybe next month. Um, I'm still finalizing the small details, but uh, it's gonna be super, super dope. I, I finally found a, a vision for what I want to do with everything and I was listening to something. The owner of uh, Off-White and I was listening to one of his his lectures and he was basically talking about how like if you're set out to design a chair, you don't need to redesign a chair. No one needs another chair. Just throw your spin on it. And it was just like my whole goal with creation is always to find a different way of doing something than other everyone else. So find my own path, find my own way of doing, um, whether it's design or videos or everything. Like it's good to replicate until you get your own style, but then transition into your own being. So deepness. I wonder how bad the echo is. I know it's bad because there's literally nothing in the room, but hopefully it doesn't sound really, really bad in the video. This is sweet. I'm gonna be, this is why I said I'm gonna be doing a lot more sit down videos because I wanna talk about I want to start like a new weekly segment where I'm talking about like kind of like hot topics, some controversial stuff, more so like oh, keeping it in the automotive realm, hopefully. And also life, I don't know, doesn't matter, YouTube, um, whatever it is, I just want to talk about cool story times, but now I have a spot to do it with a nice area, it looks good, and I'm just pumped. It's freaking sweet, I love it. All right, I'm out of here, happy freaking Friday. This is the surprise. There's a two out of three surprises I just dropped for you guys. So I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for all your support. Yeah, I should have the slap stickers in today for the, the, the fear noise slap sticker should be in today, hopefully soon. Um, if, it, if they get here before the, the video uploads, I'll throw it in the video so you guys can see it. They look really dope. So pumped, guys. Happy Friday. I love you so much. Holla at your boy, Sam.
Poverty, jealousy, negativity, tongue and Go away, go away. Poverty, jealousy, negativity. 